<laughs> I think you might be the only other person I know that likes Ethiopian food. I mean, the fact that you listen to Folktronica is just blowing my mind. And the fact that we both collect VHS copies of Jerry, Jerry Maguire. Maguire. I know. We're so compatible. You must be an Aquarius. I appreciate that. And I agree. I think we're very compatible, but I'm actually not uh, an Aquarius. Well, you're obviously a Taurus then. I mean, you pick me up right on time. You're a great communicator. And sexually, we're supposed to be, you know, really good. I'm flattered, and I would love to test that theory out, like, more than anything, but I'm not a, I'm not a Taurus. Then you're a Gemini. You're a Cancer. A Pisces. I'm a Scorpio. <laughs> oh. Okay, um, okay. What's your moon sign? What does that have to do with anything? How are you supposed to know if you're compatible with someone if you don't compare your charts on Cafe Astrology? Because you just said we have so much in common, like, ten seconds ago. Well, that was before I knew the real you. Are you joking? Anyone can say that they collect vintage postcards from the 1930s, okay? But until you compare your charts, it means nothing. You literally just said that we get along so well, and now you're retracting those statements? This is just classic Scorpio, trying to manipulate the situation and make me look like the bad guy. I'm gonna go before you say something insane like, you know, you don't think that you should keep crystals in your car. I do have crystals in my car. Save it, okay? This is what I get for dating someone while Mercury's in retrograde. I'm done. Shut up and sit down.